welcome home, Guardian. These were the first words that I heard from our founder as I entered the guild for the first time. It was followed by a volley of welcomes from the in-game chat, from the Discord server. Like, literally, my phone was blowing up from people welcoming me to, to the new guild, to my new home. Um, and, and it wasn't just guildmates. These, these guys would eventually become my friends. Uh, I realized very quickly by spending time on the Discord server with the Guardians that there is a deeper connection here than most other guilds. Uh, when I first started looking at guilds, I joined like a, a mega guild, thinking that what I really wanted was just more gear and people to be more active. In my previous guilds, I was the only one growing, I was the only one getting better at the Rancor, and uh, they started to eventually start to hold me back where I wasn't getting the gear I needed to progress in Arena and to continue to excel in Arena. Um, so I picked a mega guild, and I was put in contact with Toby. Uh, she didn't ask me anything about my roster at first. She asked me what I wanted as a player, what environment I belonged in. We talked for a while, and uh, I was concerned about whether I'd fit in with her in the Alpha Guardians, um, as, as I was still in a T4 guild, and they were getting ready to go T7. That just seemed like a big jump for me to, to jump up that. And she explained very quickly that they had a home for everyone, and her goals were to make sure that the players were happy. Uh, in the place. And to her, the, the community was more about finding the right home as opposed to just dumping people into uh, a guild based on their numbers and stats. And uh, I found very quickly that, that actually Alpha was the perfect home for me. And, and we've been really close with a lot of members. Uh, with, I've been really close with a lot of the members ever since then. There are a lot of great guilds in the Swogo community. And picking the one that can be right for you is, is very hard. Uh, no one ever talks about the pros and cons, and no one wants to, to bash each other, because it's a tight-knit community. We're friends, and people jump back and forth. It's just a matter of finding what's right. Um, and all I want to do is help you get to your right home quicker. So I figured I'd do a, just a quick little introduction of what it means to be a guardian. I mean, being a guardian, it's more about being close and being friends with people than, than how, how what I've seen at other guilds. Um, and I don't mind sharing this info with you, because we're not really competing with other guilds as our goal. Right? We're not trying to get the most number of whales. Uh, the Guardians aren't trying to uh, get the most number of guilds in, the, in, their, in their community so that they can turn around and have sponsors and marketing. That's just not how the Guardians roll. I figured the easiest way to explain that is to start with how the Guardians came to be. Um, Toby, as I mentioned, our founder, was was in the previous guild with me, and they required 600 uh, you know tickets a day, uh, attacking the you know the raids at only certain times because the raids would go down in like 10 minutes or less. Um, well, she had a player that hit the raid twice. He missed his tickets, and some people were really upset and demanding that the guys had you know be put on a stick and he'd be booted from the community. Blah 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 blah. Uh, but it was interesting because what she did is she took the time. Um, to to reach out to this player, find out what was going on, and this guy uh, had his daughter admitted into the hospital. He was spending 24 hours a day by her side, and he was still playing, trying to get tickets and stuff like that. Um, and Toby said, look, take care of real life first. And that's when she went back to the guild and just turned a lot of negativity and positivity because she stood up for this guy. She's like, no, I'm not kicking this guy out. Real life happens. And that's why um, she left kind of the guild and started the, the GGC, the Guardians Gaming Community, because she realized that we're not just a bunch of players out there that are looking for gear and, and, and you know, everything. We're, we're people behind these accounts. I'm, I'm a person and I want to relate to other people because that's why we enjoy this game. The game's fun, but at the same time, it's also fun talking about nerd Star Wars Stuff, or geeking out about what the next meta could be and stuff like that. And she wanted to take that idea and make a community around that, around that idea that, that we could be a family, that we could be friends, and, and the game comes after real life. Um, we think this works out better than, you know, a tough love situation. We've taken people kick from, from heroic AAT guilds, and <laughs> they were told they were not good enough, which just sounds ridiculous, because who tells someone that they're you're not good enough? Like, that just it just sounds weird. Um, and we turn around, and we doubled their scores in a week, and right now we've got them, um, I think they started in rank 500, he's up to 200 now, and I don't plan on stopping until he's in, into the 20s. So um, it doesn't matter where you are, guys. If you want to come out, hang out with some cool people, learn from us. If you wanted to improve Arena, if you wanted to improve uh, you know, your heroic AAT scores, we'll sit down with you and we'll start figuring out a plan of how to get you there. That's what Guardians do. We hang out, we help each other achieve goals. Because when, we, when we're all achieving goals, it just makes all of us stronger. Um, so, so that's just kind of part of the tenets of what a guardian is. We share information, we're open to all, and most importantly, we have fun because that's how we grow as a community. Everybody gets a voice. 
no bullying, no persecution. We put the community first, and you'll get what you need. I joined to have you know more activity, but now as a guild leader, uh, I couldn't care less about hitting my goals. Um, it's more about helping others meet their goals, meeting real people, um, and working together with them to achieve those, and, and that's been a very rewarding experience for me. So now it is my pleasure to say to you, welcome home, Guardian. <laughs> <laughs>